What's up, guys? It's Ryan from Ryan Go For It. That was the longest one yet. Um, so today we are going to be playing House Flipper, and I've already done some jobs so that I can actually buy my first house to flip. So here we're going. Cheapest house possible. Kabam, kabloom. There we go. Buy house. You bought a new house. Do you want to go there right now? A. Yes. So, yeah. And I learned about this game through watching Wells Knight on YouTube. If you don't know who he is, go check him out. I'm going to put a link in the description if I can remember to. And um, I'll put up how to spell his name if you just want to type it out and look it up after the video, hopefully. Um, yeah. So, here. Right away. I mean... It's worth what I spent. I only spent like 30, 35,000, 36,000, which is a lot, but not a lot for a house. So that's good. Um, now, let's see, what do we have? We have a bathroom, which is eh, a meh type deal. Now this is gonna turn into the bedroom. I don't know why they would have a bed out here. That's kinda dumb, but right away I will ching and sell everything in the house because it's um all of this is trash anyway but i can make money off of it so might as well just sell all of it now i'll come back to you guys when i am done cleaning out the house okie dokie let's go so now what i'm going to do right away i'm not gonna put it on auction yet hang on why do they not I don't have those tools unlocked yet, dang it. Okay, I'm definitely, if this is gonna be the bedroom, it's not as big, it's as, it's a little bit bigger than the bathroom, but not by much. So, what I am going to do is, I am going to extend the wall. But first of all, I have to complete this assignment, or not assignment, task, kind of like, job, where I clear out walls with the hammer. And that way I er, and that way I can earn the hammer, but I don't have a hammer, so I need to earn it. So I'll come back to you guys when I have the hammer and all the other tools. Hopefully. Okay, everybody, time to complete the job. And get back to work. Uh, so I am just about, I think I'm going back to the office now. But I'm not gonna stay. I'm not going to stay in the office because I am going to go to my new house, which I am going to flip. So now, a use browser for this house. Go to the house. Thank you. And I don't understand this comment that this guy is making. I I just don't get it. But <laughs> yeah. So house is very ugly but I have enough I know how to make I know how to put up new walls and all that junk and if you look to the left you'll see all the people like on the left of the screen you can see the people everybody that is wanting to buy the house so they're looking at the house to buy it and they're kind of giving me feedback as I am renovating it so right now I'm just gonna break these walls and this is like the first house that anybody would probably buy in the whole game. So if I do something similar to anybody, like anybody that you've seen on YouTube, it's just, it's, it's a small house, there's not much you can do. But I'm kind of gonna go with the um, expanding the bedroom and making it, because I don't know why you would put a bed out in the middle when you could have a bed in a separate room, not like right when you walk in. So the kitchen and the living room are going to be outside. And now here's this problem. I know, I think this is the same house that Wells Knight did. And I see what he was having to deal with. Um, there's this odd wall that I have to figure out how to fix. And I can't, I'm not even allowed to break it. But anyway. I think I'm going to buy a shower now, so...
Okay, now I've got all this painted up and I'm going to sell the leftover paint. Cha -ching, cha -ching, cha -ching, and cha -ching. So, I'll give you all a tour of the house now. So far, I haven't actually decorated this space, but I have completed the bathroom. Oh, I just locked myself out. With a washer, a sink, toilet, and a shower, which I can get into. And I wonder if I can turn it on. Can I turn it on? Is that allowed in this game? Oh, I can't turn it on. Useless. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so got this nice little shower space and it closes off really well. And I'm gonna put in a radiator. And the assembly on this thing is easy. All you have to do is screw some stuff in and then you're done, which is what I like about this. And yeah, so this should increase the value of the house by a lot, but yeah, so there, got that in. Now, overall, it's not the best bathroom I've seen. It's not the best one I've done. I mean, I've only done this one. Ah, I missed a spot with the paint. I'll have to go back over that. <laughs> Darn it. And then I just painted all of this white and cleaned off the ceiling and all that. And then in this space, we have a hide-a-bed that I can open, close and open and open and close. And it actually has lights that go on it. And then on this side, we have a nice little plant area and I'm gonna paint this back wall now, or soon, because I kind of had to remove the wall and move it to where it needed to be. And we have this nice plant bookcase because a lot of the people on the, um, because if you look at the left, it shows like a bunch of different people and they say things like, the one, the one guy said he likes green walls, so I put in a green wall. Put in a nice, um, Pontiac, looks like a Tempest or a GTO or something, but it says Dodge on it, so <laughs> I don't know what it is at this point. But, um, anyway, it's got the classic Pontiac grill with, I mean, Pontiac basically had everything, everything with that grill at some year. But, um, yeah, so we have this nice bed. And I, I like it being a hide -a bed because then you have all this space and I was, I spent so much time trying to put something in this little corner space, I just gave up and put a plant in. So yeah, I'll be back when I'm done painting and covering up the mistakes that I made in painting. And then I will decide what I'm going to put in here and where everything's going to be placed. Okay guys, I'm on the roof. <laughs> I bought some scaffolding and I got on the roof because I got bored, but I also bought the scaffolding so that I can clean some stuff up, like a this. So there's all this stuff that's, yeah, all these people on the on the side are like, it says, um, there's still some dirt left. Come on, clean up here. <laughs> like, I'm trying to keep people letting me know. I already know. But yeah, so. I'm just gonna clean this up and there's a little you can already see in there but here's a little sneak peek oh actually you can't see that much that's good here's a little sneak peek of what's to come and what the house is gonna look like and um, yeah or what it already looks like I completed the inside and I think I have everything that we need to actually sell the house I just need to uh, clean this up and I'm going in the house Here it is. Got a nice couch, fireplace, got a um, TV, got a nice little big fridge, uh, knives, a um, little grill, some sugar, tea holder, and sink. And a nice little island, not even an island, just more of a kind of enclosed kitchen area. We've got um, like a drying rack for the dishes and I don't have a dishwasher but that's the whole point of the sink you wash them in the sink and then you dry it on this rack and then here we have you've already seen this plant and um, the bookcase all of that 
the hi to bed. If I turn the light on and wait, wait, that's cool. Wait, does it keep the other light, the glare from the other light off? That's kind of cool. And then of course we have the confusing vehicle of the, it says Dodge, but it's obviously Pontiac. And then, and Dodge made mostly trucks for a while in the that year. That was like, probably, I'm saying, I'm gonna say 50s, I, I don't know. And then we've got another one, um, classic car painting. I don't actually know what this is because it's just a little corner. It says something but it's in cursive, I don't know. I'm not that, in, I mean, I, I really like um, classic vehicles and classic cars and trucks and all that, but I'm not like totally knowledgeable yet. I'm still working on it. Now, the only thing I need to do now to fix this house up is to wash the windows and then I think we're ready to sell it. Okay. That should be about it. I think that's everything we need to do. So I've got all the curtain slash blinds in, and they're all like half rolled up, but it's that's just how they, that's how I bought them. And they, it's hard to, I don't know if I can move them at all, but um, yeah, so this is the house, and I think I'm ready to sell it. Okay, uh, X, accept offer, I see. So we made over 13,000 on the house. That's pretty good, I'd say. Um, yeah, so I guess that's the end of the video. Okay, so we have the next, this house is the next house. The Kit Kat, you eating very loudly. Sorry, she eats pretty loud. Okay, Kit Kat, here. I'm gonna hold this for just a second. Okay, so next up we have the abandoned house or we have the, um, House after a flood, which is not sounding good. What is this? Hacker loft? Ooh. Kit Kat, hey, that's my food. <laughs> Kit Kat, stop eating my stuff, jeez. Okay, there is one that's called the house with a secret. And I think that's pretty cool. There's a house on the moon, that's awesome. Um. Yeah, so I think we're gonna buy this one, the abandoned house, next episode. And mainly because that's our price margin. Well, yeah, we don't even have enough money for the next one. Kit Kat. Yeah, she, she, I'm sorry, Kit Kat's very loud. I don't know if you can even hear her, but I can definitely hear her. She's like licking her hands now, or licking her paw. Okay, here's your food, Kit Kat. All right, so yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, let me know in the comments if you enjoyed a different game other than Minecraft, and let me know if you enjoyed this specific game, and I will see everybody in the next video.